Welcome back to the channel guys. If you're new, I'm Andre and you're watching Impressive Builders channel. First of all guys, I just want to thank you for your continuous support on this channel. Just want to big you up. Alright people. So in this video guys, you know some persons was curious how the recess light would look in the concrete ceiling, how it is going to fit. So guys, I'm just going to do a little test run and show you guys how it is going to look up there i'm going to unbox one of them and show you what is going on guys all right guys so this is a four inch led glass panel this is light and this is a three-way light this gives a three shades of light just flip the switch and it changes to the other shade so this is the one that i want to use so I'm gonna unbox this guys and show you how it looks. Give you a, a closer look at on the box. Uh, that is it guys. So it's focused right here. I'm right, just gonna unbox this and show you how it looks. Right, guys, this is it. So this is glass. And you can see the, the glass on the edge right here. This little piece, focus it, make you see it better. Piece. This little white piece right here is plastic. It's just in the middle right here. Alright, guys. So, this, these are the spring that hold the light in place when it is installed. Give you guys a closer look on it. And these are very firm spring. You see. So, it's not gonna fall out of place, guys. So I'm just gonna install this and show you guys how it looks up in the ceiling. This is not the finishing product, you know, guys. I'm just giving you a test run because some persons was curious how it is gonna look up there, if it's gonna be out of place or it's not gonna look good up there. So I'm just gonna give you a test run and show you guys how it looks up there. Yeah, peeps, so this is that is the four inch pipe that we installed in the concrete before it was cast. That is one right there. And because this is four inch recess, you have to use a four inch pipe, guys. If it was three inch, then I use a three inch wastewater pipe. This is another one right here. And then there's another one out there. So there is three on this side, and there is three on the other side over there. As you can see them. So what I want to do is install them on different switch so I can use one side. I don't want to use both sides at once and I still have the regular middle light right here so I can use that just in, in, in case I don't want to use the recess so that's an idea guys that you can use in your building some person didn't believe that this was possible not everyone gonna give you these ideas peeps or some persons don't know about it so this is why the channel is here guys to educate you and give you ideas that you can use so i'm gonna install one right here guys and show you how it looks up there all right guys i'm not the electrician peeps so the electrician will do his job and he's the one who will install this but i just want to show you how it is going to look up there so what you do is just hold up the spring and you just slide it up here yeah, like that and that is very firm guys it won't fall out as I said please this is not the finishing product I'm just gonna I'm just giving you guys a test run and show you how it is gonna look up here so as I can see, it fits very well. It's not different from the sheet rock work or board work. It's a beautiful look, guys, as you can see. So this is not the finishing tool. So what I'm gonna do is put a design up there before I install it. So stay tuned for that finishing. And if I want to remove the recess, it's very simple. All I do is just hold it and pull it out, guys. Just like that and it removes. 
It's easy to install and easy to remove. All right, guys. Give you a closer look up there. So this is a closer look. The recess light. This is not the finishing product, as I said, guys. So, as I can see, the glass cover the whole pipe. If you were using the the plastic recess, that the plastic comes straight on the edge right here, then you won't see this little space right here. So, guys. In fact, when the decking dress. You won't see that guys because the mortar is gonna cover all of that little section that you see the little space around the, the light because it is clear glass guys then you can see that little space but if it was plastic or if it was shaded then you wouldn't see that space but you won't see that after it is dressed up as i said guys this is a test run show you how it looks up here as I can see, it fits in the, the four inch piles very well. And it is not slack, so it won't fall out. As I see guys, it's a beautiful look. As I said before, it is not the finishing product. I'm just giving you a test run. Show you how it looks, how it fits up there. Because some persons was curious how it was going to look, how it would fit and all of that. So to quench your worries guys that is it so persons might have ideas that they want to use it in their homes but they were worried how it was going to look up there so as i can see guys it's very beautiful it's a beautiful look so what i want to do is cut a bun around the decking that one up there after I rough gas it and then put some design up there guys so that's one so when the others are installed when the finishing time comes guys you will see the finishing product so this is just a little test run so you guys if you were worried how it was gonna look that is the look that is how it is gonna look guys so if you want to use this in your homes or in your business place whatever you want to do with it guys it can work all right people so if you like this video guys don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you're new or you haven't yet subscribed please like the video yeah man just click the thumbs up guys share all the videos Okay, so I'm just going to remove this. So there's another piece to plug right in this part right here, guys. So the electrical wires are connected. I'm going to show you that piece. Okay, so guys, so this is the other piece. This is what the electrical wires are connected to. And there's a little you know if you want to call it a little motherboard inside this so this can be replaced guys so in case the motherboard gets bad you can just plug it off and change this section right here so this is plugged on right here guys just like this that is it and it's easy to remove all you have to do is just hold it. And remove it. So this can be replaced. I like this light guys. And you have many different type of recess. Or spotlight if you want to call it spotlight. Many different types guys. So you can choose the one that you love. And you can use it in your building or in your home. So I'm just gonna put this in the box. So guys, if you want to know the price for this, I paid $1,500 for this one. 
Yeah, yeah, it depends, guys. The price might vary, it depends on where you buy the product. So, if you know you're in the Kingston area, you probably be a little bit cheaper there. Down in the countryside, you know, it's gonna be a little more expensive because you know the price will have to go to Kingston to order it or order it and you gotta bring it down here. So, you know that the price will vary. But you can shop around, guys, and order your light or buy your light you can go to the hardware's and ask and see if you find any that you love and you can use it but i like this one guys and this is the one that i want to use so guys remember if you like this video just click the thumbs up and if you haven't yet subscribed to the channel please do so i'll see you soon for the next video